and welcome to Outwell and to our 35 litre EcoCool Coolbox. Now this has been designed to make sure that it is EEI classified and what that means is that it ticks all the boxes for European legislation in terms of efficiency and performance. How we manage to do that is by using great quality PU insulation on the inside. We also put more insulation into the lid area, which is a traditionally sort of weak area of cool boxes. But we, as I say, have more insulation in this area. And we also have uh, strategically placed ventilation on top, optimising the performance of the cool box. So as I mentioned, it's a 35 litre capacity cool box. And I just want to talk you through some of the features. So you can just see here straight away that it's actually quite a modern and sleek design. So by no means is this an off the shelf product. It is uh, bespoke to our brand here at Outwell. Now what we have is a folding flat handle, which is obviously just folded away at the moment. But what we can do is simply just raise this up, up into position like this. And then we can then choose exactly where this will sit to be able to, to carry this uh, nice and easily. What it also does is it locks the lid compartment as well. When it's in this compartment here, this uh, here, we can't actually open the lid. When it is forward is when we will get access into the inside. Now, what I want to highlight here is that we actually have a split lid function. Uh, and in this section here, we have cut away uh, in the inside while still having that good quality insulation in the lid. And what that allows for is any two liter bottles to stand in here, no problem at all. As I said, there is a split lid functionality. So what we can do if we want to is simply just leave one side open and the other side down like this, just to uh, keep that nice and cool here. But that will allow you access into this side of the cool box. Of course, you can open it up fully like this. So just on the underside of the motor, you will notice that we have this piece of plastic which is built into the motor. Now that does have a specific function and what we can do is bring the handle round into this position and what we want to do is just pull it up to make sure that it's locked into position and then what we can then do is simply sit that lid on the handle to allow quick and easy access into the cool box. Obviously this isn't something that you would necessarily have open for a long time that's going to defeat the purpose of keeping things nice and cold inside the box but it will certainly allow you access if you want to get a few different bits and pieces out of the cool box. Uh, also what I just want to highlight while the uh, box is open is that inside here we have a divider and this divider is actually an ice pack divider so what we can do is fill this with water we can pop this into the freezer and then this just slots down inside there dividing both sides of the cool box so as I say, it just slides into position in here and that then gives you the two sides within there. Other features that I want to uh, highlight to you here is on the back, we have the uh, access panel, which is actually a hidden cover here. So if I just open this up, this is where you have all of your functions. Now, over on this side here, we have a max and eco. So you again can choose um, to have it either set at the maximum performance. And what that will give you is a cool box that will cool things from 18 to 25 degrees, cooler than the ambient temperature outside. There is then also an eco mode, which you can switch that to if you don't want to be using quite as much power. But of course, it won't keep things quite as cold in the inside. One important thing that we have on this uh, cool box as well is dual functionality. So that not only is it a cool box, it's also a hot box. So just in here, there's another switch that says hot or cold. Of course, you can have it switched to off as well. But when it's in the hot position, you'll find that it will actually keep products inside here warm between 50 and 60 degrees. So as I say, dual functionality. We then over here have an option of either DC or AC. Now that will give you the option of whether you want to use it as a mains cool box or as a 12 volt cool box as well. So no matter which uh, you're using, obviously you just need to switch that uh, switch to the right position. Then what we also have is just the two uh, parts here, one for the DC cable and one for the AC cable. Uh, on here, you'll also find that you've got a couple of LED lights and one of these lights, which is the red light, will show you when your car battery is running low. So it is an indicator that perhaps it's time to unplug it from the car. So there we go, plenty of features on a really modern and sleek design, as you can see here. And that is our 35 litre cool box from Outwell.
Thank you.